Hello everyone, welcome to another video. My name is Mariso and today we're going to learn how to automatically, well almost automatically, adjust the length of your song to fit your video in just a simple clicks. So I hope you're doing well. If you're new here, please don't forget to hit that subscribe button. I create weekly content on filmmaking, photography, gear review, and editing tutorials. If that's something you think you'll be into, please hit that subscribe button to be in the know of future content. So the trick I'll be showing you today works in Adobe Audition. And if you primarily edit on Premiere Pro, this is a good thing because you can quickly send your audio or your soundtrack directly from Premiere Pro to Adobe Audition to perfectly or almost perfectly at least match the length of your video. So this feature has been out on Adobe Audition for about three years or so. And with every update on Adobe Audition, this automated process just keeps getting better. Here I have my project in Premiere Pro. As you can see, my video length is about one minute and 27 seconds and the song that I've selected is about 1 minute and 49 seconds. Sometimes when you just cut or you just fade out regardless where the soundtrack is, sometimes it may sound very abrupt and it might not be as smooth. And sometimes you just want to create a very organic sounding and a pleasant sounding shortened version of that song. But if you do not know how to remix that or if you're not an audio engineer, that's going to be very difficult. But luckily, Audition lets you do that in just a simple clicks. So let's go ahead and right click this clip and edit clip in Adobe Audition. So this will send this song over to Audition where you can do the remixing. So once you're here, make sure you go to multi-track view on the top left corner. We'll select that and here Audition will prompt you to save your project. So I'll just name it test and I'll save that. So now this is the multi-track view. This is where you need to be to adjust that remix of the song. So we'll drag that song and put it onto track number one. Once this is here, we'll head on over to the left side to properties. If you don't see that properties window, you can go up to window up here and make sure that it is selected. So once you have that, you'll toggle open the remix section and click on enable remix. And Audition at this point is going to analyze that sound so that it can seamlessly shorten or make that song longer according to the beat and the tempo of the song. And now that the song is remixed, you're able now to match the target duration. And we go back to Premiere Pro, our video length was about a minute and 27. So this is what we'll select. We'll type one minute, 27 seconds and zero, zero, zero milliseconds. There's a note here that says plus or minus five seconds because Audition is going to try to shorten this song and make it seamless, keeping all the beats and the tempo. Sometimes you might not get the exact time that you want, but Audition will get you close enough to whatever you need. Once you have inputted your new time, you just press enter and that's it. Audition creates a new remix duration. Right now here, the closest it was able to get was one minute and 26 seconds. So just under one minute and 27 seconds. And when you go to this clip over on the multi-track view and Audition, you can see where Audition made the cut to make it sound seamless. So let's zoom out over here in the timeline. We can see that Audition made cuts right here where you see a zigzag line pattern. This is where Audition made the cut to make the song seamless. And it seems like it only made those two, oh, actually three cuts. Let's zoom out completely. One, two, three, and four. So there were four cuts that Audition had to make to make that song that exact length. And if we listen to these parts of the song, It's actually quite good, it's quite seamless. If you didn't see this, you didn't know that Audition cut there, you probably wouldn't be able to even notice that there was a cut there. So magically, in just a couple of clicks, Audition is able now to adjust the length of your song to match your video. If you're not happy with the length of this song, maybe you want it a little bit shorter, or maybe this song actually ends a little sooner than you want it, you can always just drag a little bit the target duration, to make it shorter or longer and just fine tune it that way. 
And right away here, the new length is 131. When it has selected 128, you can play around the different values to get the exact match for your video. And once this is done and you're happy with this, right click on the clip, select export mix down. You can select the entire session since that's the only clip we have in this session. And we can export it either as MP3 or as a WAV file and bring it back into Premiere Pro. So once you have that exported and you have it back in Premiere Pro, I have already done that. And this is my new remix sound. As you can see, now it fits perfectly in my video timeline. All right, so this is all for today's video. It was a short one, but I hope a very valuable one. If you enjoyed this video and if you learned something new, please don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe if you haven't already. Your support will be greatly appreciated. So that is all for today, guys. Until next time.